Our top story tonight, a family suing a car company, Kia, after they say their rental car spontaneously burst into flames. It happened on the H3 freeway, and the incident caused catastrophic burns and injuries to the driver. And that driver and his family are living a nightmare. Tonight, he remains in the hospital fighting for his life. Cell phone video captures the moments after a car burst into flames on the H3. I down there, burn. The raging car fire trapping 33-year-old driver Jordan Carlton. And he has ended up with 85% uh, of his body burned and about 90% of that third degree burns. Attorney Rick Freed says Jordan and his mom Becky were visiting Oahu from Oklahoma. On June 30th, they were driving on the H3 when their 2019 Kia Soul rental car spontaneously caught fire. When I first met with the director of the burn unit at Straub, uh, he, he gave them a 1% chance of survival. Jordan's mom jumped out of the moving car. Robert Carlton says his wife is healing well, but his son's burns were so bad, doctors had to amputate nearly all of his fingers and toes. As you well know, if, if you've got children, uh, you can imagine how horrible it's been to see your son laying in a hospital bed in that kind of condition. Now the family is filing a lawsuit against the rental car company and Kia Motors. The suit alleges prior to the incident there were hundreds of non-collision fires in Kia vehicles and that Kia knew of the problem. You know, I'm not sugarcoat anything. I'm very angry. We reached out to Kia Motors. A media relations representative tells us they do not comment on legal matters. Again, Jordan was burned from the neck down. His dad saying he needs months and months of skin grafts. And while his life may never be the same, we're told Jordan is a fighter.